We are in front of Gowanus Houses. This was one of the 35 developments impacted by the Superstorm Sandy back in 2012. So as part of NYCHA's effort to rebuild stronger and more resilient and smarter, they've incorporated these new porous concretes. And what is very unique about this is this sidewalk right here. Now to the everyday passerby, it might look like your regular sidewalk, but upon closer inspection, You'll notice that there's a unique design uh, towards the sidewalk right here. This concrete, what is unique about it is that it's porous, meaning in the event of heavy rainwater or in, in the event of a storm, water will be able to be absorbed right underneath this sidewalk right here, preventing any accumulation of water, flooding that you often see in the event of heavy rainfall. And so it will go right underneath and has the capacity to hold 2 million gallons of water. To demonstrate how this porous concrete works, I have a bottle of water. So imagine if there is a heavy rainfall like we experienced in the past few days. What, how this works is that, notice how rather than accumulating on top, it will slowly seep underneath the sidewalk and has that capacity to hold 2 million gallons. Now the benefit of that is that it prevents from going into the sewer system and as a result it prevents any overflow or added pressure in the city sewer system. It's one of the unique design elements incorporated in Gowanus uh, as NYCHA's effort to rebuild stronger, smarter and more resilient. And so as you can see just from the makeup of how uh, this pathway looks, uh, water would actually come down and towards this sidewalk right here. Uh, there are so far nine of these porous concrete throughout Gowanus houses. And so rather than having a rainfall accumulate such water or puddling, uh, it will be just absorbed right underneath here. Uh, and it's a way of making this development not only more sustainable, but it's also a way to be more eco-friendly because by keeping the water out of the city sewer system, it minimizes the added pressure uh, whenever it rains. So it's a very unique project uh, that's being implemented in Gowanus. So the idea was not to just come in and repair all the damaged items, but also repair it in a way that in the event of a future storm, that these buildings are much more resilient and able to withstand uh, the impact of climate change and other heavy weather and storms.